anticipation setups for stocks which have momentum and which are likely to make 8 to 20 percent move in next couple of days. So these are stocks for people who are swing traders and they are looking for explosive stocks which can like quickly in 3 to 5 days make 8 to 20 percent move. So let's look at it. As you can see ANAC is just going sideways in a very very tight channel so any breakout above here is probably will lead to 25 to 50 dollars move on this particular stock. A very very strong stock if you see during its move it has set up couple of times very well like see here uh, or like it's a very strong stock it's been going up for quite some time so it's like in a very very strong stock. Okay. Uh, anticipation setup work best in a very highly trending stock or a stock with extreme momentum. So you have Neotonics like see here. This is the kind of setup which you want to see and then a breakout and from a breakout in five days stock make 48 percent move. So that's the kind of setup which you're looking for even here like and it was an anticipation setup and here 13 percent move. Okay, Cara uh, which is going sideways after a recent catalyst immunogen see again going sideways and that's how stocks with strong momentum they like go up uh, they have a momentum burst move of 33 percent then they go sideways again something happens and they'll break out and they'll make a 15 to 20 percent move then they might go sideways again dbvt very nice setup see the trick to doing good anticipation setups is to find stocks which have very high momentum because the stocks with high momentum show this kind of a character if you see this stock already had established momentum when it's set up as an anticipation setup here and then here like an a this is 24 percent move so this is again setting up now Altisort partner solution similarly stock has got a strong momentum in the last five six months see a couple of times it's set up here uh, it made a move of 70 percent again like here uh, made a move of 18 percent here made a move of 29 or 30 percent that was earning but so again setting up biocrest same way stock has got very strong momentum this is what you're looking for in an anticipation setup the stock should have a series of narrow range days set up very well uh, be up less than 1% before the breakout and then breaks out and then you get on that and 15% move or here like again series of narrow range day and breaks out and then has around 22% move. So again setting up Alder Biopharma play. So you'll see that like an a Gipro again setting up very well stock has established momentum has established momentum in the last four or five months. So you're looking for something which has got a momentum going and then you're looking for a continuation setup like this where explosive move happens and that is what you're trying to capture if not full move like part of that move is what you're cap trying to capture here again stock did have a uh, setup here again and it made eight percent move see the higher price stocks may not move in 20 percent increments this is a higher price stocks 47 dollars uh, MNTA again setting up very well from a setup like this it can make a move and always study the past uh, thing because these are stocks with momentum they have had these kind of uh, moves before like if you see here six or seven percent it's like 14 percent move um, here again like say it's set up very well going sideways and almost made a 15 percent move the trick to trading this is to have your profit target set at like you know, some uh, 8 to 20 percent kind of a thing and then quickly take your profit and not really like and you know, start hoping that this stock has gone up 20 percent then I will be like in you know, a rich I will buy an uh, island in Caribbean and then there will be some bikini clad girls who will be waxing my ear while I like and you know, uh, gaze lovingly at my Ferrari if you get into that mentality it doesn't work it is for somebody who knows three to five days is an ideal holding period say like here this setup at 33 percent move here again like and it is setting up and it is also setting up as part of a larger move if you see like stock has had a lot of momentum then gone sideways here and if it any breakout happens and if it happens on a high volume it can be a big breakout.
kite pharma another biotechnology play which is setting up see kite has had couple of breakouts like this uh, here so any breakout again i'm looking for it to 10 percent okay three to five days maximum hold period uh, most of the move happens in that kind of a time period see again stock has established momentum has had some pullback now setting up again from here this is a large stock large stock in the sense it's like you know has got large float large float stocks make lesser uh, percentage moves now e cent again see very very nice setup this is like and i say again as tight a setup as possible so during break can be explosive here again stock had series of narrow range day uh, breakout and you'll see that it has like an a made around eight percent move so that's like how these stocks with momentum these are continuation moves in stocks with momentum anticipation works best if you select the right kind of momentum stocks not in any stock not in stocks which are like popular with people like say apple or something those are like not moving with the same speed if they are moving at that particular time yes so selecting your stocks is very critical which is not very difficult it's just you have to use some momentum indicator now again if this stock breaks out here it goes to 195 that's a 22 percent move but like in terms of dollar it's like 30 40 dollars move or 40 dollars move possible so that's really nice setup and couple of times it had had that kind of a setup see here like and it made 24 percent move 38 dollars uh, a couple of times it set up here like it set up again uh, and you can see that 11 percent move in couple of days so stocks with momentum the key word is it has to have established momentum and also very high amount of momentum like this stock relatively doesn't have such a good momentum because it's been like and correcting a lot going a little bit little bit kind of a thing as against that if you see a stock which has very high momentum like this and this is momentum ranking it's ranked by momentum currently you'll see that these stocks will have very shallow pullbacks like if there has been pullback it has been very very shallow pullback like the reason is that something might be going right for this stock and buyers are extremely aggressive so any uh, correction is also so shallow like if you see the stock really remained near its high and then had a breakout uh, here nine percent like then went very sideways and then had a breakout okay so this is a method for those who are swing traders and who are looking for these kind of three to five like say this is a five days move okay and in five days you get like an and you can enter with like really tight stop and you're watching so you're not reacting you uh, know like you look and if it breaks out say to 14 uh, today you'll be in and then it's just like 25 26 cents at risk and if it works it might make it to 20 percent move if it doesn't work you'll get stopped out for 25 cents so similarly look at like any all these setups and these setups are the one which i'll be focusing on for today dbbt again very very nice setup this is like see sometimes you've seen setups like this in uh, anac and all and then from there there is an explosive move because why do this setup like if you see the market has been in correction the market corrected but this stock didn't correct uh, that's because the buyers are reluctant to sell that's the whole way of looking at it but sometimes like a setup which looks very nice can also break down to the downside there is always when there is a sideways move doesn't necessarily uh, although because we are selecting stock based on momentum we are expecting it to break out to the upside it can also break down to the downside so these are the stocks which i'll be watching and in order to find these stocks all that you need to do is just put in 10 to 15 minutes of effort every day once you set up all the scans you have the software and you know what to look for and uh, you you just select like say around at best like in a day i go through around 120 or 130 stocks to find this 20 to uh, uh, eight candidates and again once you find this candidate 20 is a lot of candidate so there is some prioritization which you can do where you can decide look and this is my uh, number one priority to watch today like say anac is my one priority dbvt is another one which i'm very closely watching srpt i'm again watching very closely uh, i'm watching uh, gipro and some of them i have but like they are not as high priority as others like see this kite pharma um, is one which I'm watching ESNT which I am very watching where the stocks which have this kind of like behavior where like they don't correct much near the high is my always my first priority because they are the one which 
for whatever reason the buyers are still holding on in blue so these are four five which are like first priority then you have rest which I'll be watching but like these four five I already like decided if I'm going to buy at what price I'm going to buy and how much size I'm going to buy what will be my stop everything is pre-decided unless the gap up and like make your plan completely go awry uh, everything is under your control and then you just have like an FI6 stocks to focus on and uh, they are the best of the lot in terms of using your own selection criteria. So I hope these videos help you in trying to understand how you can find your own candidate and uh, how you can once you set up a process every day come out with candidate and focus on those candidate and not get distracted by a lot of things which are happening in the market and you try and make money in your set of stocks.